Hi everyone, welcome to the channel, welcome back to the channel. Um, I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today, so we'll go ahead and get started. There's not really any rhyme or reason, I should have kind of separated stuff. I guess I can do food, but I think it's, most of it is in here, I think. I'll say that and then I'll find other stuff. First off, I grabbed these. I saw a lot of people haul these, and usually when I go to the dollar store, I'm going somewhere else too, and they'll sit in the car and these have to be refrigerated. Um, so I never buy them. But today it was a little chillier out, and I was only going one other place. Well, then I stopped to get food, but I thought today would be a good time to try them. So I did get these. So they're the Mrs. Fields Chocolate Chip Premium Cookie Dough. I love chocolate chip cookies. And this is just nice because I don't want to make a big bunch because. I'm usually about the only one that will eat sweets in here in this house. So, I grabbed two packs of them. They did have sugar, too. But I did want to mention I grabbed the first pack off the, like, area. And I actually checked the date. Normally, I forget and don't check stuff. But it was actually expired. It was from, I think, August of this year. So, in the back, they had ones that were good till February. So, I grabbed two packs of those. Sorry, the baby's out there sleeping in the seat. Um, so let's go ahead and do some other food. I grabbed, I'm going back to work on Friday, so I'm trying to get some stuff for my lunch breakfast type things. So I always used to eat these, um, yogurt, so I got some yogurt and I got two of these Sunkissed Breakfast Coconut Biscuits and you get two, you get five two packs. And these are really good with yogurt either to like just kind of dip them in or actually break them up and stir them in. And then I grabbed one box of these 25 mini candy canes. I just like to eat these, like I'll throw them in my work bag and just if I need a hard candy or whatever I'll just eat one of these and yeah that's that and then I like trying the different caramels and I hadn't seen this one before so I grabbed one of these and you don't get much in here I mean, but it's the cookie butter cream so I got those to, just for a sweet treat and then I grabbed some chocolate chips I uh, get six ounces in here. I just like to eat these. If I need something sweet, I try not to buy a bunch of cookies, cakes for myself because I'll just eat them. So I just like to keep chocolate chips on hand um, just to grab. And I do have a recipe for chocolate chip cookies back here just to grab if I need something sweet. And then... Maybe, okay. Might be the last thing I saw these before. They I also saw the gingerbread houses, but I was gonna get the gingerbread house and then I didn't, and now I didn't see any. But then I saw somebody hauling these and then I saw them last time I went and I didn't get any. But I thought I would get this for us to just decorate. There's two cookies, so it'll be fun. Hopefully, my child will cooperate with me <laughs> just for something an activity to do because I'm putting together, which you'll see in a video, uh, probably. I'll try to get this one up and then maybe the one after. I'm not sure. Either you'll see this if you watch what I got my kids for Christmas. Whatever. I'm going to stick this in his little Christmas box. I'm going to do... Last year I think I did it for Christmas Eve. But this year I'm going to do it the first... December 1st. I'm just going to put a basket together with... I think this year... Last year it was kind of difficult because he was one. This year I'm putting a little more activity stuff in. Like... So. Look out for that. So I'm going to stick this in there. Long story short. Long story short. Okay, I think that's all the food, I think. So I'll just get into random stuff now. I grab some of these um, cups. You get 28 little plastic cups. Honestly, I get these for my fiance. He chews, um, so he needs a spit cup. <laughs> so that's why I got those for. <laughs> and then I grabbed a candle lighter, because we had one, and then my son took it somewhere, or lost it. He took it and lost it, so I need one, because I hate lighting with a lighter, because it burns you and all that wonderful stuff and then I bought this like I think this is my third or fourth time buying this definitely third maybe fourth but they just work really good it's the Fisher Price brush buddies it's the toddler dental kit BPA free it's perfect for teething toddlers but this is what I use for my son he's two but also I got one kind of to save for my other baby because I thought they might run out but anyway my toddler and I I've had to throw a couple away because he's been sick, so I like to throw them away when he's sick, so he's sick again, so I'm going to have to throw another one away, so I got another pack to replace that, and I should save this actually for his stocking, but I don't know if I will. I'm going to see how much I have to put in there, and then that'll be how I gauge, sorry, how I gauge 
if I'm on stuck with some stocking or not. Um, well, you might see that in that video. I don't know. But I'm going to film that right after this one, actually. Uh -oh. I wasn't thinking, and today is like my last day of work and my older son's at daycare. So I wasn't thinking about that video. I wasn't... It just dawned on me this morning because I was going to film a different video today, minus this Dollar Tree haul, another sit down video, and then it dawned on me, you need to film that what you got your kids for Christmas because one, it's coming up fast, and two, this is my, my only day without him here, and it's just going to be easier instead of doing it during his nap time. Anyway, so that spilled, whatever. So I grabbed this aluminum foil. They have like Reynolds, but you only get 15, and then they have one that you get 40 feet. They should get 25. So I grabbed this one, which the 40 is a better value, but I feel like it's got to be really crappy. So we just need some to hold us over. I didn't realize we were so short when I went to the store last week. So, and if you hear running around to the one cat's going crazy. So I grabbed this aluminum foil just to hold us over. And this, I got two of these wire baskets. I need some baskets. I had rearranged my baby's dresser and then I rearranged it again once he was here and how things are working out. Anyway, I have one basket in there, but I realized I need it for bibs and it takes up the whole thing. So I need one for socks and I got two because I don't know if they're both. I was thinking I was going to put both in the middle because I have an organizer on this side and an organizer on this side. But I have like the middle is just all socks and boots, like booties and like little shoes that he can wear like here soon. So I got two of these. I don't know that they'll both fit, but I definitely need one for socks. If the booty one doesn't fit, that's fine. Um, I can use it maybe for something else with him. And then I grabbed two of these. I have, I cleaned out like our junk drawer, which there's not really a ton of junk in there. It's actually stuff we kind of use, but I needed a little container just to contain a couple other little things and I didn't have one. I, can, I have containers downstairs, but they weren't ones that I needed. So I grabbed this two pack of, and it does have like a grip kind of thing on the bottom. And at my store, the organizer area, not like the bins, but in the, kind of like where the hangers, I'm not sure what all's in there. It had a whole, like that whole aisle was filled with all kinds of storage bins. Like they had drawer organizers was under the bed, which I did get one of those. Like the collapsible totes, they had, oh my gosh, it was full. And I could have gone crazy in there, but I refrained. Like I had four things I was going to get and I just got one. So, but it was stocked and it was all kinds of new stuff. I haven't seen like shoe organizer under the bed. I don't know what all, all kinds of stuff. But I did get this closet essentials under the bed storage. I, I don't know that it'll fit under my son's crib. That's what I was going to use it for. Cause he has some blankets that I would like to, not a ton, but I have a few blankets that I would like to store. But if it doesn't fit under his bed, which is fine if it doesn't, um, I was going to use it under mine for maybe cause we don't have a ton of space for clothes, and I was thinking maybe for something, but I did want to get this under the bed storage. Like, I'm not for sure what I'm going to use it for. I would like to use it for the blankets over there, but I don't know if I will. But I will find a use for it, whether it's to store, like, I usually store, like, my summer clothes in a big tote or my winter clothes. So I might be able to store, like, um, some winter stuff in here. I don't know, but I did get one of those. I refrained myself. So I was going to go hog wild. Alright, and then... I got, well, I'll show you that when I show you the other stuff. Um, let me show you. Okay, I got two things of wrapping paper. I need to go through my wrapping paper. The rest of the gifts we're giving, um, I'm going to do gift bags minus the two. I might have to get wrapping paper. I don't know. I need to look under. I have a storage organizer, and I should have looked before I went. But I don't have these two people's gift spots, so I don't know if I'm going to do a bag or wrap. So I didn't go any crazy and I think I still have wrapping paper last year that I used with my son but he's loves baby shark right now so I saw this so I just grabbed two rolls and I'll just wrap whether I have extra I'll wrap the babies I think I did Mickey Mouse last year I don't know I can't remember if not I'll just wrap the babies and whatever I have from last year for him if not I'll wrap them both in this I don't know I'm gonna start doing like as they get older probably start next year I'm gonna just pick their own wrapping paper not use bows and just use all one wrapping for each kid. I think I'm going to start that. But I grabbed two. I was just going to grab one, but I think I'm going to need two. But it's the Baby Shark wrapping paper. So he'll love that. <clears throat> so, my still wrapping paper. 
And I have one kind of bigger, well, I have two bigger gifts. One, I'm not going to be able to wrap it all, but the one I wanted to get, like, a really big gift bag for, but they didn't have, like, they have big ones, but they're not going to open wide enough for me. Like, lengthwise, they'd be great, but they're not going to be wide enough for the gift. So I did get this giant gift bag, which is probably going to be bigger than I need, but I don't know what else to do. But it comes with a little tag. Um, I could just leave it in the bag it's in, but I wanted it to be wrapped. So it's 44 inches tall by 36 um, length, which that's way bigger. You get one bag, one tie, one tag. Try and get back. And they had different prints, but this was the most, like the other ones were kind of older people. Not like old people, but like patterns, not kid friendly. They had a bike bag that had dinosaurs on, which I was going to get, but the bike bag was going to be way too big. And then... And then... For the other gifts that I need, minus, like I said, those two people's gifts, um, I'm just going to do gift bags. So, I had some picked out, and then I went to the back where they had more looking for one of them giant bags. And I saw these, and I love these so much more. I did get one other one, but these um, paper bags were cool. And they had, I think, two or three other prints that I didn't get. I just needed six. So, I got the red truck with the Christmas tree. I got the Merry Christmas. And on the inside like there's plaid like this one's plaid green plaid this one's red striped and then i got this one with the tree and the deer inside is star green i do not like the baby up this is the one i didn't get i like this better than the other couple prints they had one was gnomes and i'm not really into gnomes so i just grabbed this let us know i think it's pretty i'll probably get this to my sister actually so, and then the inside of this just says let it snow. And I got this Christmas tree one that has like the 3D. And a lot of these, this one's not 3D, this one isn't, but this tree is kind of 3D. And then these couple glitter trees are 3D. And then the inside of this is green flag. And lastly, it's just Mary with the Christmas tree ornaments. And then off the side of that. And I'm pretty sure I was going to buy tissue paper, but I'm pretty sure I have tissue paper because I've done that. I don't know how many times. It's like, I think I have it, but I don't know, and then I just buy more. So, I didn't buy any tissue paper. They had cool, like, um, uh, like, festive ones, but you don't get very many sheets, and I, like, it gets thrown away, so I just get white. It's fine. Um, I didn't buy anything in the $5 spot. I saw that sign again that I mentioned, which I might not have mentioned because I did a video and I caught the whole way through, so I didn't post it. But I was going to get a sign in the $5 section, or bonus section, dollar plus section, but I didn't. I saw it again today, and I was going to get it, and I refrained myself, which this needs glued back on. Anyway, they had a bunch of these, like, kind of springy signs kind of in the back with the food. It was random. And they had really cute ones, so I grabbed this welcome. I like to set this down at the bottom of the steps. I have a fall one there now, which I don't think I have a Christmas one, which I should have got that Christmas one. Now that I think about it, but whatever. I just got this for the rest of the time, but this needs kind of glued back on. I didn't realize, which I might have done that in the bag, actually. So, And these are nice size, like, really nice size. All right, and the last little bit, I think is like stocking stuffers. I did get this, which these are women's. I thought they were kids, but they're women's, and I just thought they were so cute. It's little puppy with ears, and they had different ones, but this one had the most fun ears. Like, the rest of them were kind of just, like, poked out a little bit so I'll wear these like over leggings so people can see them but I thought they were just so cute they're by juncture okay. and then I thought this was a hat like a adult hat so I tried it on which it fits me because it's so stretchy stretchy it's by that snuggadoo brand but it actually is the kids so I'm gonna give this to talk slow I'm going to let my son use this for daycare, maybe. He has a hat that's, um, my mom got him, it's John Deere. Little hats, which I could put his name in and send them to daycare, but I think I might use this one for daycare, since if it's $1.25 and it gets lost, whatever. So, which I'll still put his name in, but. So yeah, I was going to get this for me, but then I realized it was kids, so I'll give it to my son. So we'll have to daycare. So, oh. And then I got some of these Aqua Aquarelle antibacterial travel wipes. You get 20 in here. I like to have these in my bag to wipe cart handles because at least at my Walmart, they don't have like the wipes anymore unless they come out a little bit later. But now is the time because, you know, all the sickness going around. So I like to use these on the carts. 
All right, now I think the rest of it is um, some stocking stuffers. Well, this is not for my son, but I got this. I saw so many hobbies and I never did see them and I just happened to see them today. I wasn't even looking for them. I kind of forgot about them, to be honest. But the only one they had, which this is the one I wanted, and they had Seinfeld, which we don't watch Seinfeld. They have Friends, which I would have liked to got, which I probably wouldn't have got that because I'm the only one that watches Friends. But my fiance and I watched The Office, so they had the Office Office trivia games. And I'm not sure how many of these they had. I know they had Seinfeld, Office, Friends, and I feel like there was another one. I saw somebody haul these, and I totally forgot about them and happened to see them, like I said. So this is... You get 53 cards, and it's just the office trivia game. I thought it would be fun for me and my fiancé to do one day when we're bored. <laughs> Which we're not really bored anymore right now, but maybe one day. Okay, so I got my son. I just needed a few stocking stuffers, I think. I, I think I'm good now. I really needed to evaluate that before I left, but whatever. So I saw this creative teaching materials. It's the alphabet match and learn puzzle. It's for ages three plus, which is fine. I mean, it's just a choking hazard, which he doesn't put stuff in his mouth usually. You get double sided pieces for extra writing fun. It just helps him learn. So there's the back of it. So I'm trying to get him more like crafty type stuff, learning stuff, because he's in speech. He's having issues with speech. So he's very smart. He just doesn't want to talk. But it's by Crown Jewels, actually. Crown Jewels Kids. So I got this. I thought it would be fun for his stocking. 26 puzzle pairs. So it would be fun to match those up. So I got that for his stocking. And then I wanted to get him Kinetic Sand, which I was going to suggest to, like, his grandparents. And I didn't. I did, like, the dot things instead, which somebody might still get him. But I did want to try it. And I was going to get him a set just myself. But I need to stop with his Christmas stuff right now. So I saw this, and it's Grand Fix. You get three sands, three molds, and then it's like kinetic sand, I believe. So you get this, which I know it's super tiny, so it's probably not very big, but it's perfect for him just to try it out to see if he would like it, because he's kind of weird. Like, he'll play with Play-Doh, which I did get him Play-Doh for Christmas, but he's weird about it. So I just wanted to get this to try him, which is perfect for $1.25, and it can be a stocking stuffer even better. Because I don't need more big gifts. I need stocking. And then I saw Mickey. He loves bubbles. He likes Mickey. So I saw this, which I know it's not really bubble season necessarily, but... And I thought about saving this for his Easter basket, but I'll probably get him something else later. So I probably will give this to him, even though it's not bubble season. <laughs> Just the stocking stuff where he loves bubbles. And we've had two bubble machines this year, and they both broke. So... And I got... Right before the last one broke, I got this big container of bubbles so he sees that all the time and wants to play, play with it and we don't have any way to blow bubbles so we got that and then lastly I got this um shore fresh reusable 10 cup container lid but I got this for him to play with the sandwich I'll just keep this somewhere and then when he gets it and we play I'm not going to give this to him for Christmas but it's just and it has a lid I had a tray that I think would be a lot better it was like about this width but it's longer but it had holes all around it which I was going to tape or put paper or something around but then this had a lid so I thought it would be better which it's not as big but it should be big enough for him just to try it out so I got this for that and I think I got everything for the Dollar Tree haul so thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you got ideas all that fun stuff and don't forget to subscribe if you like to follow along and I will see you guys next time thank you for watching